Hey, what's up, guys? Jason Gain here, Gans Army. Hey, guys, all doing? All right. So, uh, hey, man, had a good weekend this weekend. It was WrestleMania, some uh, great matches. Uh, you know, night one was awesome. Uh, Rhea and Be Becky, that was a great match. Uh, you know, Sammy and Gunter, another good, another great match. Uh, great to see R Truth win the titles. The tag team match was uh, Seth and Cody. Versus Rock and Roman. The only thing about that, I think it was, uh, it went a little, it went a little slow. It went long, it was a little slow. It just needed to be sped up a little bit. But other than that, it's a great match, you know. And uh, I'm filming this on Sunday before WrestleMania, so I'll break in uh, and we'll uh, talk about what happened afterwards on night two, okay? So we'll see what happens there. All right? All right, I'm breaking in here. Man, what a night two of WrestleMania. I'll tell you what. Starts off huge. Drew. And uh, Seth, what a great match. I mean, even thought it was Seth, I thought Drew was going to win it in the first two seconds. He hit the Claymore. He didn't get the pin, though. Then it goes on. Drew ends up winning. Like, oh, my God. You know, he finally wins. And then he starts talking smack to CM Punk. Punk drills him. And all of a sudden, what? Judgment Day. Here comes Damian Priest. Priest cashes in the money in the bank. Damian Priest is now your new world champion. How freaking awesome was that? I mean, that was crazy. Like, like for like a minute and a half or two minutes, it was like it was just crazy. Like, what's going to happen, right? Like, oh my god, right? So that was cool. And then uh, let's see here, what was the next one? Um, you had the Street Profits and uh, Bobby Lashley versus um, AOP and Karrion Cross, which that was a cool match. I mean, I really wasn't. I really, I'm not a big. It's like, okay, I like the Street Profits. Like Karrion Cross, they've done, he needs some changes though. But I do like the Street Profits. I'm not a fan of Bobby Lashley. I just I just don't like him. I just, I'm not a big fan. But I did like how Bubba Ray Dudley as the uh, the referee. You know, they, you get the what's up. You get the tables. Get, him, get the tables, right? So you had all that. That was awesome. That was pretty cool. Then, you know, they had a three-way match with uh, Logan Paul, Kevin Owens, and uh, Randy. That was all. I wish I wish either Randy or KO would have won. I'm not a fan of Logan Paul, but hey, it was a good match. It was a really good match. It was pretty cool. And then you had Bailey and EO Sky. Man, great match. Great match. You know, Bailey brought it. You know, EO Sky brought it. She's a, she's a heck of a wrestler. Bailey wins. Love that. That was pretty awesome. Uh, I know I'm saying awesome a lot. Sorry, guys. You guys know how I do. You guys, you guys have watched this channel long enough. You know, so I like to use the same words a lot. My bad. Uh, and then you had the biggest match of the night. Roman versus Cody. I loved it how, like, you know, they were keeping it in the ring. And then they then they went out tight to a little bit, but they brought it back in. They weren't out there fighting all the time. They didn't bring a lot of weapons in. You know, um, I thought that was pretty good. And then, you know, here comes all the interference. You got Jimmy coming in. You got Jay. Jay spears him off the stage. How cool was that? That was, man, I was like, whoa. Right? And then you got Solo coming in. And then you hear it. Shh. Can't see me. Here comes John Cena in. Cena takes him out. And then you got The Rock. The Rock coming in. Takes out Cena. And then here comes Seth in. Chew, you know, oh my God, how awesome would I be you know, if it had been Moxley or you know, Ambrose and Seth, right? But Seth comes out, boom, Roman takes him out, and then all of a sudden, it goes black, and you're, dong, dong. Undertaker shows up, oh my God. Shows Seth with the rock, what's going on? Oh my God, how insane was that? I was still waiting on Stone Cold to come out. I was hoping he was gonna come out, but he didn't, but hey. Undertaker coming out, Cena coming out, wow, and then Cody, the three crossroads, boom, 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 one, two, three, he's your new champ, ah, he did it, how, man, that was great, that was, yeah, that was a great night, I tell you what, night two, I thought, was a much better night than night one, night one was really good, I thought, it was just a couple slow, oh yeah, I forgot, um, AJ and LA Knight, you know, uh, LA Knight takes a win, uh, it was not bad, it was not a bad match, but yeah, with the rest of what was going on, the rest of the matches on there, it's kind of like, oh man, you know what I mean? So like, but yeah, that was a, that was a great. It was a great WrestleMania was great this year. I thought it was really good. I think every year it's getting better and better. And I last year it sucked because Cody didn't win, so they kind of like took the air out of it. But with Cody winning this year, it was, it was you know I think it was a great WrestleMania, 
and uh, I enjoyed it. All right, guys. Hey, let's get back to the um, the unboxing and stuff from uh, the channel. So, hey, talk to you guys later. All right. Anyway, so uh, let's get to weekly purchases because I got some good stuff this week. Well, this this is not this is what we're gonna open today. We're gonna have a big bow up today, so that's cool. We're gonna open him up, review him, let me put him to the side. So weekly purchases this weekend. Uh, Star Wars Club had a uh, had a uh, swap meet. I went, uh, you know, pay my dues. I went, and I, I sold some stuff. I also picked some stuff up, right? So I picked up. Uh, I think the figure is Revan, uh, the FAWS Sith Trooper, sweet looking figures. You know, I, I paid twenty bucks for both of these. So that's a good deal. Uh, I picked this one up for a dollar. Goes on my uh, weird shelf, right? That's cool. Uh, and then I picked up this Batman. Night, uh, Batman Collection 1000 for ten dollars. Great deal on that. And then I picked up this. I love, I love watching the uh, the DC shows on the CW. You, know, you got Arrow, Flash, uh, Supergirl was on our right. Um, but yeah, I love Legend of Tomorrow. That was a great one. But I picked up Canary from that one. So that's pretty sweet. Uh, might, might see if I can find Deathstroke. Might have find these other four on that. Uh, but that was a cool one I picked up for five bucks. You can't beat that. That's a great deal. And then, you know, on Friday, me and Lakin went uh, grocery shopping. She was out with me. She was off work. So we're in there and we're at Walmart. First thing we saw, I picked up was AEW Punk. Uh, so that's like, you know, the Luminaries. That's where he's, you know, he's Ring of Honor. So that's pretty awesome. Picked him up. Got that. It was a great one. Uh, I picked up his Mad Libs, Taylor Swift edition. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I also picked up this Who Is Taylor Swift from, uh, um, you know, there. They got a lot of those Who Is books. And I was reading one. It was like, Who Is, uh, one, you know, when I was teaching, it was like, Who Is uh, Robert E. Lee? I'm reading this thing, and there was like four or five errors. I'm like, someone did not proofread their history on this one because these are all wrong. Anyway, it was like, where he was from, um, a couple of battles he was in. He's like, yeah, that's not, that's not correct. But whatever, I'm, I didn't make it. And then... Uh, we went to Five Below. I picked one of these up. A little mini grill. We'll see how it works for the uh, for the six-inch figures. Might be kind of cool. We don't know. We'll find out. And then, of course, my Throwback Thursdays on um, on uh, TikTok. I got picked up this Blackest Night uh, Black Lantern Firestorm. So that it looks pretty cool. Uh, I also put some more guys, in, a couple guys in layaway for their. You know, one was like a hundred buck dollar figure. I'm gonna put him in layaway. Inner Geek. Uh, just so I get, you know, I get that one because you know, I, you know, that's it's easier to do that, make payments than to actually like drop a hundred bucks at one time. You know what I'm saying? So that's what we did. All right, so let me uh, movies out of the way. We'll pick up Big Boa and we'll open him up and check him out. All right, so give me a minute. All right, guys, I'm back. So here's Big Boa. All right, so let's check him out. Uh, you know, he, he just looks cool. Uh, you know. It's kind of weird sitting with that with us um, unmasked because you know we're not used to that. Of course, you know it shows him when he's on the back. He's number one fourteen. Uh, you know I, I do like seeing these these uh, these boxes like this. I do miss the yard work on the other boxes, but still seeing them like this is cool. So let's get him open. You know, he's got that cool cool cover art, which we'll sits to the side down over there. Let's get him out. Boom. Boom. Got the gloves. Oops. We got. Boom. Alright. Test looking. He's got a good waistband. He's got butterfly shoulders, man. He's cut up. I like the uh the chest plate, chest on him. He's got the bloody knuckles there. That's pretty cool. I mean, yeah, collar-wise, he's, he's a pretty basic collar, basic figure, you know. Uh, he, he is pretty cool, though. Now, he comes with some 90-pound dumbbells. That's neat. I would like to see. I wish we could get some more of these. That would be cool, right? Uh, now, we'll say on this one, the, the gloves, he's got like the, the, the wrist, so when you take the hands off, you take his hand off here. Uh, you get his hand off, but then you got to put the cuff on, right? And then you put the glove on. So there's that, 
Okay? So that's cool. Um, I will say that now you can take his head off. If I can get his... Oh, well, that's easy. Then you pop his... Help, help put, put his, you know, his masked head on like this. Yeah, the only bad is... Try to get that on. Those spikes... Give me a second. Hold on. All right. I'm back. And the only thing bad is... Uh, getting that on there with them spikes. It kind of hurts, man. There we go. That looks freaking... He looks really cool, though. I do like this figure. He looks pretty cool. Like I said, it's a plain figure, but yeah, it's still pretty sweet looking. Right? So I do wish he had the, um, like, like, his, like his original Joe figure has the, um, oh, the punching bag with it. That'd be neat. But this is great. You know what I would even took? And uh, you guys are going to be like, oh my God, you're an idiot. I'd even took a, uh, make him a deluxe figure and give him a whole weight set. A little squat rack. Little some plates, so like, I mean, I would have done that. I would take that. Okay, that's just that's just me saying that though, right? I mean, I know you guys might be like, oh, I don't want to pay a deluxe figure with all that. I mean, I would. I would pay. For, I would pay for more more for a deluxe figure if they gave us um, your diorama pieces for it. That'd be great. I, I would love that. Anyway, like I said there's not really a whole lot here to talk about on Big Boa because he is a basic figure kind of. With his gear, I mean, you know, he, he's got good look, good leg articulation. Look at that. I mean, he moves up well. He moves well. Look at that. Does a split. I mean, great articulation there. Uh, you know, the double knees. He's, you know, his arms have pins, but his knees are pinless. But still, it's a great looking figure. Great, even though it's like I said, it's a basic figure. It's still a great looking figure, right? So yeah, that's that's awesome. So that's a uh, big bow right there, guys. So, uh, guys, I hope you enjoyed the review. Like I said, that was Big Boa. You, know, you saw the weekly purchases. Uh, come back on Friday. We'll open someone else up, something else up. Um, let me think, what else? Oh, I did get an email that uh, Retro Scarlet will be shipping at some point. So that's great. Love that. Um, let me think. Let me think. What else do I got? I think that's all I got right now. Uh, yeah. Oh, I am going to AEW on uh, Wednesday. It's in Charleston again. I'm going to AEW. So Friday, we'll talk about that. Hope they'll have some videos, some pictures. Maybe we'll see a meet and greet. I don't know yet. We'll just find out. But um, yeah, that's all I got for you guys. Hey, hope you guys have a good week. I'll talk to you later. You're dismissed.